Hello and welcome to our video series on FileZilla FTP. In this video, we will be showing you how to set up your connection. Now remember, as you're watching this video, you can always use the pause and rewind buttons below the screen to watch and rewatch this video until you have this task mastered. So now let's get right to it. And of course, the first thing you want to do is open up your FileZilla FTP software. And this is what it looks like once you've got it open. Now let's head on over to the file menu in the top left corner and click on file. And there where you see site manager, go ahead and click on that. Now let's go ahead and create a new folder for our personal site. So scroll on down to where you see that new folder button, click on that. Now let's give it a name. Now let's create a site to store into this new folder. We do that by going down here and clicking on the new site button. Now let's give it a name as well. Let's go ahead and type in the name there. Next we're going to have to enter the host. And this is part of the information that would have been given to you by your web hosting company. So if you don't have it, don't remember where you wrote it down at, give your web hosting company a buzz and ask them. Now here we want to enter the port number and usually this is going to be the number 21 unless your web hosting company tells you otherwise. Now let's hit this drop down arrow under server type. Let's go ahead and select FTP. because That's typically the one that will be needed. Again, unless your web hosting company tells you otherwise. And now under logon type, for most of the servers, this should be normal. So if yours is already selected as anonymous, let's go ahead and check normal. Now let's enter the username. Again, this and the password will be additional information given to you by your web hosting company. Now the username may just start with an FTP, if, if that might help you remember where you put it. Let's go ahead and put in the password here. And check this box if you do not want FileZilla to remember your password. And if you check that box, you better have your password and username written down and stored safely somewhere. Now, you want to check this box if you want to make this particular website your default FTP site, which comes in handy if you've got several sites set up here. Now I'll just go ahead and click on the save and exit button. And after we do that, let's go ahead and give it a shot and test everything. And we do that by heading back over to the file menu over on the top left corner. Click on File. Let's go on down to Connect to Default Site and click on that. And if everything was set up properly, we should connect to the server here in just a second. There we go. And this screen verifies the connection to the site. Fantastic. Good job. Now this is going to bring us to the end of this video on how to set up your FTP connection.